Uh, that's right. Good morning, Evan. I mean, it is coming down. It hasn't stopped pouring since about 415 when we got here. And as you can tell, there's a lot of water rushing into this storm drain right to the right of me. And then just beyond that is where the sinkhole is created. Now, Jezebel, Jer Jerbeck Park is to my right. And where the stairs leading down to that park is where this is closed. Now, I'm at the end of a cul-de-sac on Summerwood Court. And let's take a look at some of the video from uh, earlier when we could actually see what's going on. The City Parks Department was quick at work on Monday removing hazardous trees that had been uprooted in the original collapse. The area has now been more securely corded off, um, which has led to a more long-term closure of the staircase. The city hasn't provided us with a timeline on repairs. However, they do expect the rainfall this week will likely extend how long those repairs will take. So again, uh, not expected to be open anytime soon. Now, a sinkhole that opened up in Encinitas is even getting bigger. The city says Friday, last week's rain expanded the hole. Repairs are now expected to last through April. April, the sinkhole appeared last month in Cardiff on Lake Drive after a round of severe weather. And since then, city crews have been moving utilities and shoring up support structure underneath the road. Now, of course, with all of this damage, we spoke to a geologist, Pat Abbott, who says the rain really does expose the weakness in human infrastructure. How much more is it going to erode? It totally depends on how much more rain and how ferociously it comes down rather than come down light or does it come down hard and heavy kind of a thing. And it is coming down heavy again here in Scripps Ranch. If you're heading out the door, grab that rain jacket. Make sure it has a hood and an umbrella as well. As you heard, Evan, if rain is expected to really last over the morning hour. So please be safe on those roads. And if you see any caution uh, signs, caution tape, closed roads, please understand that it could be very dangerous. Our soil is very moist. The roots under our trees uh, again could be unstable. So make sure just stay clear of any of those closed areas. I'm Dana Marie McNichol coming to you live from Scripps Ranch.